this. When you are saved, you might not have everything that you want right now, but God's not done yet. Because in the end, when you end up in heaven, there's going to be joy, unspeakable joy. There's not going to be any more tears. There's not going to be any crying. There's not going to be any sorrow. There's not going to be any pain. You're going to be in heaven, enjoying the very presence of the Lord. But those that are living in sin, they think that things are going well. But just as in the blink of an eye, when the light is taken from them. Everything that they seem to have gained is going to vanish right away. And they're going to look up in the place of darkness where there's wailing. Have you ever been in a place where everybody is crying and yelling and screaming? It just gets on the last nerve. Imagine being in hell and everybody's in pain around you. You're in pain yourself. You're crying and there's no escape. You're screaming and hollering and there is no rescue. There's nobody coming to your but listen, I'm glad that's not you and I. God said, He's not done with us yet. But when we get to heaven, oh, come on, somebody. When we get to heaven, we're going to shout victory. When we get to heaven, we're going to dance. When we get to heaven, we're going to praise Him. When we get to heaven, No, no, I'm not drinking today. I'm waiting on the Lord. You gotta be on. 
right there in 1 Thessalonians chapter 4 verse 16 for the Lord himself shall be sent I can't wait for that blessed day. All faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. I'm not hoping for a car. I'm not hoping for a new house. I'm hoping for that day when the Lord breaks forth from the clouds. Faith is the substance of things hoped for. It's the evidence of what I don't see. I don't see him just yet, but I know he's coming. I don't hear him just yet, but I know he's coming. And I know I need my faith. Keep holding on until the Lord comes. He's coming back for me because he loves me. He's coming back for you because he loves you. You might not think that the Lord loves you, but the Lord loves you so much that he's not sending somebody else for you. He's going to come back himself. And all he's asking you to do Jesus. 